right, it's the end of video three of my digital nomad life in Jeju Island. Uh -oh. Hey guys, officially arrived at the hostel. Look how cute this place is. It's so weird because I'm editing this video for episode 3 of my digital nomad life in Jeju Island. But just like looking back at all these videos, I mean, that was the first night that I was staying at Mido Hostel, which is the hostel that all of us participating in the program were staying at. But I was the very first person to get there. Um, so I just had that night to just like look around and just imagine and just think about all the events that would happen. And in, you know, in anticipation of waiting for everyone else to get there, I heard something about like it being like around eight, eight girls eight guys or something like that and it was just like i was filled with so much um i guess excitement but also a little bit nervous just thinking about you know who's gonna come like who am i gonna meet are we all gonna get along and just kind of like the story that we're gonna write in our time there One of the first people to get here, so super excited. Let's go check this out. This area is the girls' room, but there's all these different rooms, and I thought this was so cool. There's a hair dryer and hair curler or straightener. So this is the kitchen area. Quite cool. Quite. Hey guys, so this hostel is actually quite nice. Um, I think I'm just gonna go to sleep a little bit early today because I'm so tired and I have to get up early for a coaching call. Um, yeah, just gonna call it a night, but I'm super excited and as I'm waiting for other people to get here, uh, I feel quite nervous and, I don't know, anxious but also very excited. Um, yeah, we'll see what this whole experience brings. It's so funny because uh, people kept messaging me saying like, oh my god, it looks like you're participating in like the Korean terrace house. So for those of you guys who don't know what Terrace House is, it's a Japanese variety show where basically a group of young, you know, millennial guys and girls, they live together in one house. And that's kind of like what we were doing, you know, we were working on our own business, we were working on our own stuff, while at the same time all living together. <laughs> and it was so funny because my friend was like, oh, like, little Sharon achieve her uh, career goals and also find the love of her life <laughs> So funny Hi, so I just finished my morning coaching call and it was our last coaching session with this client and honestly I feel so grateful to be able to work with this amazing amazing girl and like not only that after our coaching call we actually like started ideating for a different thing that we're gonna start working on together so it's amazing how as one thing ends another thing begins um so yeah like honestly super super grateful and for today uh, i'm gonna meet with a friend it's so crazy that i came here and i realized that there's this friend that i i met in boston when i was in college he's also here in the area so we're gonna go um uh, maybe like grab some food and just like explore the area but that's all i have planned for today and we'll see how everything else goes hello <laughs> long time no see <laughs> it was so crazy 
crazy. Like, what are the chances of me running into this guy who I haven't seen for years since I was in Boston for college and we happen to be in Jeju Island at the same time? Guess who I met? Si Chan, when's the last time we saw each other? I think like three, four years ago. Yeah, three, four years ago. Yeah, yeah. yeah probably. It's been a while. It's been a long time. <laughs> But also, this day was, oh my god, it was so, so hot. hot! Oh my god, it's so hot! Oh, what is this? Ton and Samgyeok? Like tonkatsu? Sounds good. It does sound pretty good. <laughs> Killed it! Fish just casually chilling in the middle of the road. You know, no biggie. Why so sad? <laughs> wow. something <laughs> it's really refreshing for this hot day oh Guys, look at this cool rooftop up here. Wow. Marketplace again, the place that we were at in the morning, but it looks so different at night. Look at this, it's much more lively now. Look how packed it is. So, we're gonna grab dinner with Si Chan and Si Chan's aunt. So friendly. They have sunglasses on. <laughs> I'm styling. <laughs> Look who's here! Welcome to Chechu Pond. It's gonna be roommates. <laughs> it's gonna be so fun, guys. Watch our journey. <laughs> 
in the next episode on behind the scenes of my life as a millennial entrepreneur starting her two-month digital nomad life in South Korea. This is the building where the co-working space is in. <laughs> Bonnie, are you excited to go check it out for the first time? Yeah.